This is his absolute joy in life right now. His eyes will change colors, his feathers will ruffle. These are signs of stimulation and signs of happiness with the bird. So I'm letting him kind of delegate when he wants to do it. One of the ways Tico lets me know that it's time to start playing is he'll start to vocalize. sing don't you that's when we know it's time to perform i think that freddie mercury is harnessing tico in some way shape or form i'm not superstitious but i just see a great performer in him when he's performing. Tico's flamboyant personality comes out and he arches his head like he's looking over a stage. It's bizarre in so many ways. I've never seen anything like this. He's one in a gazillion. We're usually bonding for at least five to seven songs and he's just as happy as can be once it's done. After a jam session, sometimes he wants to hang around with us, so he actually steps up on my arm. Hey, buddy, how you doing? How's it going? Music has molded his behavior, no doubt about it. I had a, a rough and tumble relationship with Tico initially. Come here, buddy. Where are you going? I was the one that he always bit. <laughs> ah, don't be chewing that. Don't chew that. No. One day we were home, I'm playing acoustic, trying to practice my chops on it, and the bird starts screaming. So I didn't throw in the towel, I walked over and I started playing it. I noticed that there's more to it than him trying to yell for me, he wanted to sing. I started playing in front of him, he started singing more and more. So now we're like best buds. Jake, good boy, Tico. I feel gifted. I have a bird that's so happy and he's brought us happiness. I want to keep this thing going as long as possible. It's a cool magic we have together. <laughs>